All right, time now to take a look at what's trending nationwide and it has a lot of you right here in our area talking this morning. The New York Fire Department will not hire a decorated Navy SEAL because he's 37 and they say that's too old. So he took the written exam, passing in the top 1%, and at no surprise, he passed the physical test as well. The fire department, though, has an age cutoff of 35 for military vets and 29 for regular recruits. The department saying it just can't make exceptions for one person, so is 37 too old? You see right now at the bottom of the screen, guys, we've been asking all morning long in our live survey, should we just do away with these age restrictions? And 82% of people are saying yes. The thing is, clearly it's not too old there because there are currently 37-year-olds and much older people right. on fire department. Right, started way across. earlier. Yes. They're saying this for starting, which I still think is an arbitrary sort which of... Which really doesn't make sense to begin with because if someone is who's serving right now in their 40s, then a recruit should be able to be the same sure. age. And I think sure. that a lot of people didn't realize there was an age restriction, and yeah. that has a lot of the conversation going. If you caught Daily Blast Live yesterday afternoon, the show that airs every day, 2 p.m. right here on NBC Charlotte, that's where this conversation really got going. And people now, just all across the country, have something to say about it. Absolutely, yes, I'm a former firefighter. We had a 39-year-old in our recruit class. Aside from that, firefighters are much older than 37 at a retirement age. So if you can do the job, age should not be a disqualifier. Now, we're also seeing this person and say, if there's an age restriction, why do you see a lot of older firemen? Carolyn, something you were asking as well, but they do start earlier, but they're still in the program. So yes, that is a valid question. I have a feeling this guy would run circles around most of those 25 year old candidates. They just don't want to be embarrassed. So people, you know, of course, chiming in with some humor, but of course it's, it's kind of just an interesting question. Like we said, we, we were unaware of this age restriction to begin with. So a lot of people saying they can't make exceptions for one person, but if they're qualified, passing that written exam in the 1% and no issues, with the physical. We want to know what you think. Hashtag wake up CLT and you can weigh in on this poll all morning long as well, you guys. Yeah, because what, the, what they're getting at is, is physical skill. And if you can right. pass a physical skill test, I mean, I think we all know people in their 30s, 40s, and 50s who are. Who, and, who wouldn't be able to pass. Yeah, right? and then some who would be perfectly right. able to pass. A lot My of people saying is, also he was a former Navy SEAL, so he's obviously very well shape. trained in sure. shape. And hey, heroes come at all ages, right? And he was doing something prior, so it's not like yeah. he just was sitting around waiting to take the test. He was actually serving the country. Right. Rachel, thanks.